Hi guys, so I thought I'd bring you an update on the dawning, as we know, is coming next week, and we now know that all four maps uh, for SRL are going to be available, and those two new maps, the Mercury map is called Shining Sands, and the Plaguelands map is called Hawken Precipice, and some screenshots you can see as we scroll through here, but what um, I guess is, is important to know is that Amanda Holiday will be um, offering daily bounties. Those bounties are going to be available during the event. And the progress that you had on the previous record book, if you got that last time, uh, and this record book obviously will be available in this uh, event. But ongoing after the event finishes, that's when SRL will hit your private matches playlists. And in there... Anything that you haven't completed in those record books, you will then be able to complete in the private matches, which is unusual because you can't do that in uh, private matches for other Crucible things. So I have some screenshots of the book. It's called Competitive Spirit, and there are two pages to it. One is for Sparrow Racing, and the other one is for the Vanguard Elite Scoring, Strike Scoring. And you can see here the Sparrow Racing has in it to the finish. I'm guessing that's completed matches. Uh, precision racing, or maybe it's completed matches without dying. Uh, precision racing, uh, that would probably be gates hit. Tricky, obviously tricks. Speed bumps, that would be enemies that you kill. Uh, red racer, I'm not sure about that one, a maximum velocity. Uh, but then you've got sand speeder and slalom. So sand speeder would obviously be your best time on the shining sands uh, mercury map. And slalom is also the Plaguelands map. Then we have the Vanguard Elite Strikes uh, medals uh, page. And we've got here Heroic High Score, obviously best score. Champion of Night, I'm guessing that's a Nightfall score. Score of scores, not sure. Obviously scores of some kind. Bounty Hunter must be some kind of medal or particular. Um, bounties completed probably from Zavala. Pot of Gold, Killing Spree superhero and all the medals so they'll be interesting to see exactly what's required for those but you can see them here and i'm um, looking forward to hitting those as well other Im important updates are the ornaments that you would like to buy well now there's going to be a kiosk where you can buy just like from tess everest you can buy things like emotes now you're going to be able to buy ornaments like these um for from the ornament kiosk so if there's a specific one you want you can buy it. The downside is it will cost silver. So Scott Taylor, one, the executive producer for Rise of Iron, talked about this in an interview with IGN, and I'll link that in the description below. But uh, he has specifically said that this will be available for you. Uh, green engrams are going to auto dismantle into materials now. So that's so good because they just take up so much space for no reason at all. Strikes are going to be uh, given the SIVA combatants in all the three new strikes. And if you want to complete strike scoring, strike scoring will be available in both the standard SIVA crisis playlist and the heroic crisis playlist, as well as in the nightfall. So uh, those bounties will be available from Zavala and you can pick those up there. Now, um, you can see the names of the ornaments I've put in this uh, video as well for you. So if you've got any questions, anything that you'd like to know about the dawning coming up, please hit me up in the comments below. I will answer as many as I can, as quickly as I can. But I hope you got something out of this video, Guardians. Please hit the like button if you did. Uh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter and on Instagram, BoilerRoom81. Tell your friends, subscribe to my channel, and thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.